Hi, everybody. This is Diane Jarecki at Readings by Diane, and thank you so much for joining me today. If you are following me here from my YouTube channel, thank you for being here to support me. I truly appreciate it. And if you are new to my work today, I am just going to introduce you to who I am and what I do. So I read tarot, Lenormand, and playing cards. I pretty much focus on the Tarot de Marseille system. So although I may switch out decks when I'm reading, it's all going to be within the same Tarot de Marseille sticking with the traditional, because I do very traditional ancient cardamancy. Um, I also read the Lenormand cards. If you're not familiar with those, this is a system that is very popular in Europe and came to the United States about 20 years ago. It started to really explode about 15 years ago, and I found it 10 years ago. I love this system because it's everyday symbols, things that we recognize and have associations with. And so it's very easy to understand what these images are telling us. And then the playing cards. This is the oldest system of cardamancy that there is. And I tend to, again, stick to very traditional basic designs, although a little bit prettier and different most of the time. Um, it's amazing how much information you can get from the patterns of just a regular deck of playing cards. And then I do sometimes, if I have time, I wrap up with an extra message for spirit, especially if that's asked for. And for that, I keep an oracle deck handy. This one is one that I read with very intuitively. Being from a coastal region up here in New England, I love these sea images. If you can't tell, that's pretty much a theme through um, at least a couple of the decks I've shown here. <laughs> and uh, so I read the cards in response to a question. So once a question is asked, I'm going to shuffle the cards. I will then tell you what I'm seeing in the cards. If you are watching this on video, you'll see me show you in the cards as I hold them up and explain what I'm seeing. So I will give a visual for those who are watching in a visual media. I am very direct, although not like, blunt to the point of hurting anybody, okay? Uh, it's not my point here. So I'm not like rudely direct, but I am very straight and to the point, very honest about what I see in the cards. I always say, I'll tell you the truth, the good, the bad, and the ugly, and the beautiful, all of it, <laughs> okay? Um, so I will be taking live callers and doing one free reading per show because that's really all I'm going to have time for in a mini show is one, you know, live reading. And then if I do have a little free time, we'll either do that message from Spirit Wrap or I'll talk a little bit more about some of the cards. I'll be choosing the system because I use my intuition for that. There are times I get things out of a particular deck that I might not get out of another one, and my intuition guides me. Sometimes I'll reach for one deck and be guided to use a different one. Uh, for example, recently I had a question where that happened. Whoops, trying to find the camera. And not doing a good job. Okay. So anyway, uh, yeah, we'll get this in the camera. There we go. Where a question was asked about what somebody was doing with their money, and it 
came up for me the this coffin card in this deck i could see that as kind of a bank vault as somebody putting their money into safekeeping hiding in an account or something where it was kind of locked away whether that is like a money market or cd but it was something vault like and I wouldn't have gotten that from any of the tarot cards or the playing cards. So I will feel into what deck and system I'm guided to. Some provide better answers to certain questions than others. And I do read on all types of questions. I and mean, I've been reading tarot for over 20 years. My very first readings with both tarot and oracle, before I even knew anything about either one of them or even what they were, were for other people. So I have a long history of reading for others before I even became a professional reader. Um, I'm very intuitive. I often pick up on hidden information, things that you didn't tell me that I will like be given the, that message, that that history or energy of the situation. And that's how it works for me. A very strong intuition, that empathic connection. And I do feel it through the screen, over the internet, over the phone, if I do phone readings. I do have a website where you can reach out to me at www.dianjarecki.com. A Facebook, let me fix that, www.readingsbydiane.com. <laughs> Sorry, first show, a little nervous. and. My Facebook page, Readings by Diane, and then also Readings by Diane YouTube channel. So you can reach out to me through any of those. I do content that is educational on my YouTube channel. That is a new YouTube channel for me, though I'm not new to YouTube. That is just a new one I've started in order to kind of put out some more educational content around the cardamancy and as I study them, numerology and astrology. And eventually I will be adding those readings into my services. Here I may not be able to do them. It depends on whether or not I can get information in advance. That's going to be a ways off first before I start doing that for anybody. I'm in the study process for both. <laughs> have a lot to learn. So just a little bit of my background. I have been studying metaphysics since my teens. And I don't judge people. I've been through a lot. I've made a lot of mistakes. We all do because we're all human. So we're all in the human condition. None of us are perfect. Another little fun fact, the, uh, the Amish actually believe that only God is perfect and actually intentionally put mistakes into their work. So, you know, spirit, God, that may be perfect. We humans are definitely not. So it's not my place to judge anybody. I'm a safe space. Private readings, obviously. Public, what you put out here is going to be on the air. So, you know, that's up to you. So, I hope you will tune in every Tuesday from 3 to 3.15 p.m. Eastern Time. And listen or watch and enjoy the show. And I look forward to reading for you. 
I welcome all questions, relationship, career, spiritual path. I offer guidance on any question that you have. So, I'm going to try to make this fun and educational, informational, and inspirational. And with that, I'm... offering you much love, much light, many, many blessings for now and for your future. Look forward to speaking to you, reading for you, and I hope you'll join me.